next on five, a transportation nightmare involving a trailer carrying a massive steam turbine from Pensacola to Bruton is causing confusion and curiosity tonight. The equipment is grounded on the Alabama-Florida state line in Century. Transporting the 25-foot-tall turbine to the Georgia Pacific plant is taking much longer than expected. News 5's Pat Peterson has more on the delay and excitement the giant turbine is generating on its difficult journey. How do you transport a massive steam turbine 55 miles through two states on a very busy highway? It's a monster. Very carefully. It's a logistical nightmare, I can imagine. The generator turbine began its journey at the Port of Pensacola Monday night. The giant piece of equipment, which is 25 feet tall and 174 feet long, was supposed to arrive at the Georgia Pacific plant in Bruton this morning. But transporting crews have been delayed. I heard about it on TV and uh, had to see this thing. It caught some trees up there. Utility crews have been forced to cut, pull, or remove about 500 power and phone lines along the way. Did you lose power last night? or? Yeah, my TV went on. His, I mean, it just jumped off and jumped back on. So you lost electricity for a minute? Yeah. To avoid heavy weekend traffic, including local homecoming football games and festivals, the 14-axle trailer hauling the turbine will stay parked in Century until Sunday night. What is it? The steam generator going to Georgia Pacific in Bruton. Uh -huh. The turbine has caused quite a bit of excitement. I've never seen one this tall and this big. Alabama Power customers in Flomitson have been told to expect power outages Sunday night while crews try to maneuver this monster through town. The outages will be brief and localized while crews cut or remove lines to let the turbine through. In Century, Florida, Pat Peterson, News 5. The turbine should arrive at the Georgia Pacific plant in Bruton no later than 6 o'clock Monday morning. Expect traffic delays on Highway 31 between Flomaton and Bruton Sunday night and Monday morning during the transport.